What's up everyone? I'm Jeff Teague. This is Auto Jeff Reviews where we look at the entire automotive industry. Today we're looking at Toyota 2023 Toyota 4Runner. I'm going to tell you some changes that are coming new. This is not a 23. Okay, so this is a 2022 4Runner TRD Pro in lime rush color. You don't see that many of them. They're rare. But anyway, 22, the exclusive color for 2023 is going to be Solar Octane. It's that bright fluorescent orange color that you see on 2022 Tundra. We're going to see that Solar Octane TRD Pro color on 2023 Tundra, 4Runner, Tacoma, and Sequoia. So the whole entire lineup is going to be consistent. Solar Octane Orange all the way across the board. Which one of those do you like best? Toyota has kind of a tradition where they take the exclusive, we'll call it, or the unique or the hero color, TRD Pro, and then the next following year, they put it on other trim levels. So I'm guessing that we're gonna see this Lime Rush 4Runner color on other trim levels, maybe TRD Off-Road Plane. It wouldn't shock me to see Lime Rush on SR5 4Runner, on TRD Off-Road 4Runner. I suppose it could even be limited, although it would be pretty crazy to see that blinged out with Chrome as well. I don't know, we'll find out in the coming months which trim levels are gonna get Lime Rush, if at all, but I see it coming in my crystal ball. This is Blind Spot Monitor. Blind Spot Monitor and Rear Cross Traffic Alert that used to be only on TRD Pro Limited, SR5 Premium, and TRD Off-Road Premium, and then available on the TRD Sport 2022 Forerunner with the technology package. Now Blind Spot Monitor is gonna be standard on all trim levels and rear cross traffic alert too. Another addition to the 2023 Forerunner lineup is gonna be the 40th anniversary edition. Looks like an old Hot Wheels car, right? Really cool. But anyway, it's got yellow stripes, orange stripes, red stripes all over, even a little badge on the inside based on SR5 premium trim level. So to have soft tech seats on the inside, look at these bronze wheels, really cool stuff. What do you guys think? Do you like this one? There are only 4,040, 40, 40, to go along with 40th anniversary edition. So you'll wanna get it quick if you wanna buy one of these. So that completes what's new for 2023 Forerunner. I'm gonna walk around this one and just show you what's special about a TRD Pro 2022. I think there's some really cool features that do make it one of the toughest vehicles on the entire planet. So remember, blind spot, standard. Rear cross traffic alert, standard. Lime Rush will probably be on other trim levels. Solar Octane, TRD Pro color. 40th anniversary edition. New. I kind of want to do this one vlog style. So we've got these 17 inch TRD alloy wheels, black with red lettering. And then we've got these Nitto Terra Grappler all-terrain tires. TRD Pro is going to have LED headlights, daytime running lights, LED high beam and low beam, and then LED fog lights as well. It'll have a multi-terrain monitor. There's one of the cameras right here, that Toyota grill. It also has a TRD skid plate, very cool stuff. 9.6 inch ground clearance. It also have hood scoop with decal there. This has Toyota safety sense on it, so it'll have pre-collision system with pedestrian detection, lane departure alert, radar cruise control, and automatic high beams. Has color key door handles with smart key, push button start, Then it has the Predator Pro step bars, has that TRD exhaust with TRD labeled exhaust pipe, 5,000 pound tow capacity, black badging, big giant, very functional roof rack up there. This has the power vertical window. And then this one is coming with the sliding rear cargo deck. It pulls out, you can sit on it, you can work on it, all that kind of stuff. Can I get this open though? Come on, Jeff, you got this. Come on, we're gonna see my struggle. There we go. See my struggle? One-handed, baby. It holds 440 pounds. I see this as being a great tailgate device. You can sit there and watch your kid's game. Maybe even a little bit of rain going on here because you got covering. You can work. Why do I say you can work? Because, well, you've got this power outlet right here. We've got tie downs. 
Oh yeah, and this vehicle is tough. I say it's tough because it has crawl control, low speed cruise control that can get you out of a tough, sticky obstacle. It's got multi-terrain select so that you can select the type of ground that you're going on. Loose rocks, sand, gravel, big rocks, moguls. It also has locking rear differential. It locks the back wheels on the same axle so that they turn at the same revolution. They do the same amount of work, active traction control. We've got home link for garage door openers. I see a standard moonroof. I also see soft tech seating, black with red accent stitching. You'll see TRD in the headrest. The seats are very comfortable. It drives nice. Nice soft touch here. We have a power passenger seat. Little carbon fiber look there. We've got heated seats. That's that button right there, auto for the power vertical window in the back. This one has USB ports added to it in the front, USB there, got USBs in the back. I think it has five. Dual temperature controls, digital, eight inch multimedia touchscreen. This has Android Auto, Amazon Alexa, Sirius XM, leather wrapped steering wheel. I don't have the vehicle turned on, but that's what the display looks like there. Push button start. And then we've got up here, lighted, Visor. That would be nice if it was LED. Ooh, pretty. Pretty, pretty. Let's go here. Ooh, me likey. Lot of room back here. Lot of room. And then what do we have? Drink holders. We've got cup holders. Ugh. So we're waiting for Forerunner to be redesigned. We don't know if it's 24 model, 25 model. We don't know that yet. But the powertrain is gonna be the same that we've seen for years. What is it, Jeff? Forerunner brings you 270 horsepower and 278 pound-feet of torque matched with a five-speed automatic transmission with this 4.0 liter V6 engine. How about that? It's tough. I've taken this off-roading before. It can get you out of a jam. It can be three wheels down, one wheel up. I've seen it. I've done it. It's very exciting. Please hit subscribe if you want to join the channel. I look at the whole automotive industry. We'll look at all manufacturers, all brands. There's a lot of fun, interesting things to see. And we look at being thorough here, but we also have some fun here. So we crack jokes. We tell pop culture stories, all sorts of stuff you'll be hearing movies, songs, TV shows, video games, anything we can think of while we tell you everything about the vehicles that you want to know about. So I'm on Instagram at Auto Jeff Reviews, and I'm on TikTok at Auto Jeff Reviews. Thanks, everybody. Peace. Whoop.